What's up guys and girls on the internet? Leo here, and that's the first posting of myself on the Phaser channel, so I need a quick introduction before we jump right into the video. My channel's focusing on FPS, so you're gonna mostly see Battlefield content on there, obviously Battlefield 3 at the moment, but also some bad company. Not so much COD 4, but I may be posting some COD 4 as soon as I get a little bit better with it. So if you like stuff like that, then just Click the link in the description and subscribe to me for more content like the one you're seeing at the moment. Which is a perfect transition into the topic of the whole episode. So it's like Battlefield for Dummies. That's what my series is gonna be on this channel. In the background you're seeing some TDM footage from Sane Crossing. It's a 15 kill kill streak. I just cut out the all not so interesting parts. As many of you know Battlefield is a kinda hard to play game for people who have never played a game in the series before. So that is what you're gonna learn from the series and what you can take onto the battlefield. The class system. What is it all about? How do I know what to choose in which situation? Basically there are four classes. The medic, the support, the recon and the engineer. Every class has its special purpose and can do stuff better than the other one. Obviously the recon is gonna be good for long range, the medic yeah, kind of explains itself. Support is the one who can drop ammo and the engineer is the one who can repair tanks, kill the tanks. So the names should be self-explanatory. But you have to know stuff about each class to know when to choose which class. So we're gonna start with the medic class. The medic class in Battlefield 3, I gotta say, gets the assault rifles. The assault rifles are the best rifles in the game. They also get the the fibrillators and the mad pack. So basically the assault class is the most played class in Battlefield just because of all these three great things. You can heal your teammates, you can revive your teammates if they're dead, then you see the little flash over them and you can even shoot the assault rifles which are the best rifles in the game. Next up will be the support class. What is the support class good for? The support class has the LMGs and obviously the PDWs which are available for each class the LMGs have a really big magazine capacity, so you can fire a lot of rounds down range and suppressing your enemy. Suppression is another mechanic that's especially good for the support class, as the bigger guns, which would be for example the LMGs, have a bigger effect on the suppression of the enemy. So first of all you can lay down suppressive fire, you can resupply your friendly allies with ammo and grenades and every other thing that they have equipped. You can also quickly destroy enemy vehicles with your C4. You also have the mortar, which can be useful, for example, on Saint Crossing, uh, the first bomb, the B bomb in Rush, is really hard to get, so you can mortar in there and kill the people inside on places you're not able to reach otherwise. You also have the claymores, which you can place in tactical spots, although people on the battlefield don't really like people who are used to claymores, so maybe sit back a little bit. The next class will be the engineer class. The engineer class has carbine weapons which aren't as good as the assault rifles but come close in some ways. They also have an RPG or a small which is a rocket launcher to destroy tanks and other vehicles. You can even destroy helicopters with them. They also get AT mines as well as a repair tool to repair or damage vehicles. Finally you can also equip Iglas or Stingers which are lock-on missiles against aircraft as well as Javelins which are laser designated missiles. Then there would be the Regan class which gets sniper rifles, MAV, spawn beacon and another little motion detector and the Sofalum which is a laser designator for the Javelin missiles. Okay so that was the basic class introduction to Battlefield. This was for Battlefield 3. If you have any questions related to Battlefield just type them in below and I'll see you next week. Hope you enjoyed it.